tonight. Little Rock police are investigating two violent cases in Midtown, including a shooting at Park Plaza Mall Friday night. And in a separate incident, police are also looking into a, who attacked a man inside a nearby gym. Fox 16's Tyler Thomason joining us now to explain that. Tyler. Yeah, guys, both of these cases, while unrelated, happened on the same night, just yards away from each other in an area that's known for shopping, dining, and living. There's a hustle and bustle that never stops near Markham and University. There's a lot of shopping and food. There's a Target right there. TJ Roberts and his four-legged friend take a stroll outside for a little relief. They've lived here about a week, and in a way, crime in the capital city has already shown up on their doorstep. Roberts lives in a complex next to this LA Fitness. It's here a man told police he was attacked while getting a drink of water after a basketball game. During that game, there was some type of altercation between some gentlemen, uh, which led to an assault later on. It sent the victim to the intensive care unit. The police report states he had a broken cheekbone and bleeding in the brain. Also on Friday, just a few yards up the road, officers showed up to a shooting here at the parking deck of Park Plaza Mall. A police report states detectives found a car window shot out and a trail of blood, but no victim anywhere. A set of extra eyes appeared to be in Park Plaza's parking lot Monday. Some remain on edge, but Roberts thinks it's not too much to bark about. Sometimes things just happen, I guess. It doesn't really change my opinion of the area. And Little Rock police have not named any suspects in either of these two cases. Guys? Uh, you, you know what? I'll just say this. People who live in that area, they love it, you know, but things like this do scare people. What's next in the investigation? What have police told you, and should people be afraid? Well, they seem, as of right now, pretty isolated, just involving the two people in each case or a couple people in each case. But as for the LA Fitness uh, attack there, police say they're going to go through surveillance footage and uh, member check-ins for that day and during the time frame when people were there uh, to try to try to narrow down a suspect in that case. And as for the shooting at Park Plaza, uh, police did not get in touch with any victim. No victim has come forward. So that case looks to be a little more difficult. It's okay. very interesting, especially with a trail of blood. Yeah. All right. Thank you. Little Rock Police.